and it's second sound at LAX. Not the uh, worst fight in the world. Good couple of movies watched. Great Gatsby and The Hangover in preparation for this weekend. And now I think my bag has just arrived on the belt. So I've got to grab that and then jump in the car to head. I think about three hours into the desert for where we're staying for the festival. So it's going to be amazing. We're on the ground in LA. Let's do this. Bright and early day one here in Coachella. Look what's right here. It's the festival ground. But look what's right here. It's the healthy, let's do a bit of sightseeing and try and get a bit of a run-in squad. So here we go. So that is how you start day one here at Coachella. We've got the A team over here. That was the worst mistake of our lives. It wasn't, it was the best. It was the best amazing. one, best one. UK 17 Coachella, baby. This one here can hustle. She was out at the front, running hard, keeping us honest. But to give you guys an idea, this here is the compound. And this, across this road here, is Coachella. That's how we do it. Honk, honk. Anyway, I think it's about 9 a.m. here. We're gonna go in, grab some eggs, chill out, and get ready for what is gonna be an epic, epic, epic first day here in the Coachella Valley. From me at the compound, day one. Let's do it. I was saying, Okay, it is day two here in Coachella. The squad is here, we're assembling. We're a man down right now, so we're just waiting because we do not leave a man behind. Check this out, we're in the desert. We're in the desert. We're in the desert. We're in the desert. Look at this. And this here, Coachella day one, you guys are coming too. It's gonna be off the chain. Guys, can't lose. Here we go. So we're now backstage at Coachella. When I say backstage, there's the stage. Lucky enough to be hooked up with some artist passes for the weekend. So we're here, it's early afternoon. We're about to go listen to some cool music and hang out with some cool people. Coachella, baby. It's the final day here in Coachella. We've just been at Katy Perry. Now, 
sidling across the main green to go and see a little bit of music, have a few drinks, and just chill out in the sun. The final day of Coachella. It's been amazing. <laughs> So that is it for Coachella. Sneaking out the back door, the main stage is here. This here is all the golf carts of all the artists leaving. It's time to call time on Coachella 2017. It's been an incredible three days of music, fun and festivities and now time for bed. I haven't slept in about 24 hours so from here I'm gonna jump into bed and then tomorrow we head to LA to have a little bit of downtime before returning back to London. So Coachella, you've been Good morning, it is day one here in LA. We got here safe and sound yesterday after about a six and a half hour drive. It seems that everybody leaving Coachella had the same idea as us. So we were almost bumper to bumper for the 150 miles into LA, but we're not your typical LA place right now. Look over my shoulder, that is the sea. We are down here in Malibu for a little bit of a beach workout. Max and Tom know a couple of the guys here, so they've invited us down bit of a functional training session on the beach, perfect way to blow off those Coachella cobwebs and start life for the next couple of days at least here. This guy here, actually. This guy here absolutely destroyed us on the beach. Also, the best Arnold Schwarzenegger impression in the world. That's right. Gotta keep working harder. <laughs> Legend. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Thank you. So, what a great way to finish the workout here. And now there's only one thing left to do, and that's go and have a little feed somewhere in Malibu. Not a bad gig, is it? go what a day final day here in Los Angeles it's been an incredible week nice chilled couple of days had a wicked day in Malibu yesterday great training session caught up with some some friends had a really nice chilled day and then today has been similar up here in West Hollywood right by the shadow Marmont had a nice breakfast nice lunch and now I'm about to jump in an uber and get myself to LAX to catch my flight back to London 
It's been an incredible six weeks on the road. Lots of things ticked off the bucket list. But I'll tell you what, I am actually really looking forward to getting back, seeing the family, getting my head down at City Athletic and doing some work. Body power's not too far away. So from this episode of Body Power to Body Power Vlog, I'll see you guys back in London.